Hello everybody and welcome to Pignet. If you're not familiar with my channel, nice to meet you. My name is Jessie and you're catching me in the middle of a series that I'm calling the 13 Copic Doodles of Halloween. Today is number four and if you've missed the previous animals in this series and would like to catch up, I'm going to have a playlist linked in the description box below. All art supplies used in this drawing can also be found in the description box if you're curious. Today's theme has been saved for this drawing in particular and it's something that's been bubbling up inside of me, and that is self-doubt. Specifically self-doubt as a creative individual. Being an artistic person, which by the way, I kind of hate the word artistic, but being a creative person, I guess, means that you're volunteering to ride on a roller coaster of feeling amazing one day and feeling completely awful about your work the next day, and that just goes up and down like for the rest of your life, basically. Whether you're just starting out or if you're a seasoned professional in the creative industry, everybody feels like this. This is completely normal. Everybody has these days. And it's funny because I was just watching Bailey's video. If you guys watch Bailey on YouTube, let me know. Comment section below, let me know if you watch Bailey. She was just talking about this because she was just having a day like this. And it's like, that's funny because I've been having this too. So I bring this up because as the days are looming closer to the start of the launch of this series, I'm feeling more and more self-conscious about it. As I'm recording this, it's October 17th, so the series is going to start in two days. So as it comes closer, I'm feeling more and more self-conscious about it. And I'm worried that I won't be able to keep up with it. I'm worried about the animals I still have to color and how they'll turn out. I'm worried about the videos not being received well. And I chose this bear drawing to go with this theme because, to be honest, I wasn't really happy with how it turned out. But I knew if I just kept going back and recoloring every animal that I wasn't super pleased with, I'd be running out of time on uploading and then the rest of the animals would be rushed, so it would just it would just basically be a waste of time. This morning during our morning dog walk with Luna, I told Justin I was like, I'm worried that my Halloween series on YouTube is stupid. And of course he was like, it'll be fine and you'll get them done and blah blah blah. And then towards the end of the walk, he admitted that he's worried about installing the sliding glass door on the back of my office. He's worried about not doing it right and not getting it done in time and it's kind of been holding him back from getting started. And I just thought, man, this is ironic because his sliding glass door installation is my 13 Copic Doodle series. And I know for myself that these days of self-doubt that I have are just that. They're just days and usually one day I can feel awful and then the next day I feel fine. And it's funny because I have these feelings about my YouTube channel all the time. Like some days I'm like, I can't believe so many people like my channel and like this is really going well and it's being really well received. And then other days I'm like, this is stupid and I should just quit and I don't know what I'm thinking of doing this. I know that once the series actually starts, I'll feel better and I'm, I'll probably get like a new wind of like motivation. But for now, I'm just going to keep going because in my experience, when you're feeling like this, and you're having self-doubt and whatever it is that you're doing, the only way to get over it is to understand and accept that it's just a feeling that will pass and to just keep going. That's what I'm going to keep doing. So today Justin is busting a hole in the wall of our house and I'm preparing this fisherman bear to be uploaded. If you enjoyed this series so far, let me know by giving this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you want to see more, and leave me a comment below telling me if you are also on this creative roller coaster of pure bliss and self-doubt because I'll be curious to see how different people deal with like those down days, so let me know. I think it'll also be helpful for people to like see that it is normal, you know, for people to come forward and say like, yes, I deal with this too, like, yes, that's normal. Thank you guys so much for watching and for being here to support me and my channel, and I'll see you guys tomorrow for day five. Got loves me from Halloween Town. Definitely another one that I torture Justin with every year. He loves it. He also loves Teen Witch. What a classic.